Hello and welcome everybody back to League of Fun Gentlemen Warfare with NO 1800. In the last episode we built this little heavy industry district, which is working quite well if you ask me. Also we can expand easily upon it. Yeah, I really like it. And yeah, in this episode we are going to focus on the city, but I have to mention I forgot something. As you know, I built these two for our uh, for our window production. But what I forgot is that sewing machines also need uh, need wood. So since we have three that are working on 200% efficiency, we need to build three more lumberjack huts. So we have over 1,000 of each resource in our in our storage. So that is great. And that means that we can. Our economy will die temporarily. It will completely die once we do it. But okay, let's start first with our tourism income. Your city has grown uglier. You lost an influence bonus. And we got all the items back, right? Good. We did not lose all these animals. Because that would have been very sad. You lost an influence bonus. Yeah, but I won influence points. Isn't that great? Okay, then time to get rid of everything over here. You know, that is the kind of stuff that really hurts. But hey, if we want to work on all of that on an infrastructural level... Then we have to act quickly and do some radical steps. Dun, 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 dun. 
So, time to get started. Okay, the first thing that we are going to lay out is the track network. What we are going to do, because it basically works like a highway in other city builders, is we are going to form a ring around the majority of the island. And then it will branch out into certain directions, like for example this one, to support this sector. The question is, are we going to do it with a single railroad? Or a double one. I believe a double one would be uh, working quite better. And I remember people saying that you can't build tracks near each other. Well, what am I doing here? So, that works. Oh. Okay, and it's time to get rid of that one single monument that was still standing there. So here we now got our main ring, a single track ring, I might add. Yeah, I know that my workforce is running short. I mean, I got rid of workforce over 21,000 people. Uh, 11,000 people. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. I sometimes believe that the main uh, that the main intention of this game is Check to make copy. me angry. interest you in this recently polished app no changes really workforce shortage so
So we are going to surround the inner ring. Yeah, I made a little mistake. So this is also the area that we can uh, use for city building. We're in the presence of a virtuoso. An inspector. Okay, what can the inspector do? That is what I ask. The fax police station. Okay. Gang as last I am writing a postcard. Uh, I just need someone to deliver it. Okay, then. But I believe a single shortage. single track will also do it. Workforce shortage. Yeah, repeating that every two to three minutes doesn't make it any better. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. Also repeating the same message for each population class doesn't make it better. Workforce shortage. Okay then. start by building a bank since it is the largest building so and here we'll create a little shortcut through our city The bank has an enormous area of influence, as we can see. Game save. Good, that is one public building from here. So then there's another public building we need to take care of, and that is the power plant. We are not going to build only one. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I wonder how well that will all work out now that I'm placing it freely. out in a distillery in novel an explosion in one of your factories hey so many
Okay then. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. And again, the game wants to remind me every couple of seconds. Oh, you're really Work short of workforce. Shortage. Workforce shortage. Okay, that here su works surprisingly well. We can build a, a factory, o uh, a power plant over there. <sighs> and another power plant over here, which will also have a positive side effect that we can um, move the charcoal burners. You reached a new milestone. Over charcoal kilns, or however that has been called. So you guys can now be happy because you have the access to the goods. I count our blessings every day. Also, no wish unfulfilled, right? Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. I bet we are still going to hear that quite often. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. On the other side, they also want a university. And the workers want a church. Game save. And some of them require school. And the pub always counted as luxury. But I still will keep it built, because as we found out in the campaign Let's Play, a missing pub still, um, still causes some issues, because it will lead to negative headlines. actually works pretty well, especially considering that I did not count the amount of tiles. So here we will get a little better placement. I'm really surprised by how that is working out. Yeah, here it does not work. But still.
still, this is so amazing. Okay then, are there any more public uh, buildings that I have to build? Let's see. One, two, Work three, four, shortly. five, six, seven. Two, Work three, for four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, Work five, six, shortly. seven. Five, six, seven. Workforce shortage. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Workforce shortage. And the game is not trying on purpose to be annoying. Okay, so, um, electricity only runs until there, so building another power plant over here. Festival has ended. Does that work? The people celebrate your leadership. I hope we are not running out of building materials anytime soon. Oh, game, shut up. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. No, apparently the game doesn't want to shut up. It just wants to see me suffer. Workforce shortage. Workforce shortage. Game saved. I'm still not happy with the placement of this power plant. Especially regarding that I was apparently too stupid to count properly. Okay then. That opens up new opportunities.
Okay, und hier... So, that also works. In the meantime, I'm going to build up a timber production for us. that I know how ominous this uh the shape looks, but for that it's facing the wrong direction, so no, this is not a swastika. This is the symbol that does not cause so many issues. stronger brick production we could need a stronger brick production game save Okay, why can't you upgrade? Because there's a market not in reach. We not have trouble enough. One market as a temporary measure over here, and another one over there. And slowly but steadily, our economy is coming back up. As we can see, we um, don't need that much workforce anymore. Uh, I mean, worker workforce. But at least as a temporary measure, we are going to need even more timber. Especially considering that we are now spending way too much time in this episode.
So this is now going to be the thumbnail. This was part one of a restructuring. And as always, I hope you liked this episode. If yes, please consider giving it a thumbs up. It's always a great feedback for me. If you, well, if you have any direct feedback, suggestions or whatever, then just type it down in the comments. I will make sure to read it. And yeah. If you want to join the community, get into direct contact with the community, then please feel free to join our community discord. You will find the invitation link in the video description. And yeah, if you want to get notified whenever I upload something new, then well, just subscribe to the channel. I make sure that notifications are activated. And with that, I say goodbye and see you next time in NO1800. Bye bye.